Let us continue playing the Sun on the Sea. When we last left off, we were excursing to team colonists everywhere. First off, though, we're going to go to Godfall, get another port report, because we're basically sleep when you're dead. Okay, I'm going to tough this one out. Lose a terror, but we still have the wound to worry about. So, we arrive in Godfall. Pretty much the only reason I'm here is to do the Old Blood. Which gives us a Z story, a Tale of Terror, Memory Distance Shores, and 8 Fragments. And then we go off shouting. Gives us the port report of Godfall. Um, I am going to explore the Citadel probably next time I'm here. I'm surprised I can't actually use my summon box for this, but it's okay. And from here, we're going to go to the Isle of Cats because we have money. And the cat folk, well, they can give us money. Apparently they'll give us more than the um, Ryan Bruiser would, but he wouldn't turn up, so he's lost the chance now. And I can also get them refilled if I'm feeling suicidal, so there's that too. Because we are nearing... Um, we're nearing Aesteval. Aesteval? What are we going to call that? Aesteval, maybe. Aesteval, maybe. Yeah. Alright, Estival. Which we can actually try and set up a colony on, which is interesting. Still. Isle of Cats to start with. And then we'll start working our way up. Let's see if there's anywhere we haven't actually found. Which I don't think there are too many places left we can, but there might be something I've missed. Doc. Port Cavendish. So, we will, of course, compile the port reports. We will, of course, sell some sunlight. A tough challenge. I failed in the challenge 500. And I've lost the sun catch. Oh, okay. So, losing the challenge means I don't get the box back. This is what I kind of checked. Yeah, so I do get the box back if I get that, but I get slightly less money. Overall, though, this is a more preferable option, and I'd prefer to have the money right now. Okay, so I lost a couple of boxes, which I think, on the balance, is probably not the most terrible thing that could have happened. What I will do, though, is I will use my newfound wealth to go and pick up some more fuel and a supply. And let's see what else I can do here. Red honey. Now, we know the Admiral wants some red honey. Let's go to the honey tongue first. Swap tails with a honey smuggler. I have his attention. We'll have a meeting with the King's Claw. Can never have too many friends in beneath. Uh, okay, we'll be pa we'll have patron. There we go. Here's where his office. Accept a new commission. Smuggling a prescribed cargo of red honey. Okay. That's just awful, isn't it? Um, oh, just checking this now. Do I actually now have to... to be alarming scholar? Do I have any? Oh, I do have some. Okay. Dangerous to even be properly le illegal. Of course, he's taking it into London. Unfortunately, he's the guy who wanted it, isn't it? The Alarming Scholar. Yes, he is the guy. Alright, fun times. We're going to do some smuggling in a bit. Uh, let's see about this. Yeah, I can already have one. I can only have one, and we've decided on the way we want to go with. But hey, we have some honey. I could even just abandon this and just give it to um, give it to the Admiral, because he wanted some, didn't he? That being said, I'm going to move on. Uh, do I want to get a visage, or do I want to do the Empire of Hands, or... Actually, someone wanted something at the Empire of Hands. I think I might have needed the port report there. 
Oh, the crawling stars. Okay, recall for change and assign a name. 50-50. We were unlucky. The crew is fed, and we'll do Visage Empire of Hands. And then we'll head north to Irem. The good news is, though, we did get to pick up a lot of Echo, so if we do suddenly die, you know, money money recovered at least. So we can go captivate a couple of get gain a couple of captivating treasures on the way back as well. Or as I go at Khan Shadow, but for now, Visage is fine. Compile the port report. Something awaits you in port. We don't have that effect currently, so port report is all we get here. Alright, to the Empire of Hands. How's I terror looking? 34. It's gone down because we've hunted a couple of things since we've been here. But I'm going to keep the light on anyway. So it wasn't we here either, actually. Thank you, Giant Spotlight. We feel happier in your presence. And we dock. So, Bustenton, we are going to poke around the shore, because why wouldn't we? Compile the port report. Gather strategic information for the Admiralty because he wanted that. Gain an intriguing snippet and a Z story. Audience with the civilized mayor. I could acquire some fresh supplies. God damn it, people who want to give me soul want to have my soul. I want my soul. I like my soul. Wild Bill Court can arrange a more efficient supply for thing. Um Hmm, delightful adventurous will get enough cells to power this thing, will she? Okay, I'm game for that. Let's go perhaps not. Back to port and let's see where Let's go here. Lost Treasure Hunter. Uh, one day see something he recognizes. Dine at the captain's table. During a raid on the Empire of Hands. Now we'll return to the boat. I was kind of worried that it might actually cause me to be injured. Um, Wild Build Court. Inspired associate parties to inquire about your willingness to meet. <laughs> okay. Um, high price souls, prize quality over quantity. It just wants me to lose my soul. I, I like my soul, as I've mentioned before. But, oh dear. Alright, visitor in court. Silent gallery. It's definitely not ready. 
I need a hundred souls, really? Uh, I only have one. Alright, so I'm going to return to the castle side. I don't think there's anything else I can really do here, then. Fountainhead Islands. Let's see what the ancient tombs and buried treasure have. Okay. So the Vault of the First Emperor. Okay, let's head in. So I thought archaeology is now five. We need foxfire candles though in order to enter beyond that, so we're gonna leave the vault. Uh, nothing I can do really. Alright, that's all done. No shops here I need to worry about, so we're gonna leave port. And head north. So I think, um, yeah, the Channel 8 is the next place we can really get to. Channel 8 and then up to um, Estival. And hopefully, from that point, we'll have some plan. For a better better, because we are entering technically unexplored area. Nope, and nope. This looks safe. This looks so very safe. Xana's reach. Yep, nothing bad can possibly happen to us now that we are here. We hope. Okay, Channel 8. Leave Shore. Shore leave at the Channel 8. 31% chance. We can obtain the doomed monster hunter. But I think we will go and compile the port report. And we shall say Tales for the Bone. Darn it, I could have managed this. Hunting trophy needed. Okay. Hearts. It's not like, that's the big uh, monstrosity thing we've seen a couple of times, actually. Um, so, it says now I can sell that for a Searing Enigma. Unfortunately, there doesn't appear to be anything else I can do here for the moment, so that's just going to be a port report and run. This is channel, and I think we'll get up to this. We'll add some more, um, we'll do some more light trickery. And then we'll see what happens. Why does Aelus fear this place? Because of the light. I'm hoping there's some supplies here actually because otherwise we're going to be in a bit of trouble soon. Alright, we dock. Sun! Fill up Mary Cat's box. We have one wound so we can take another one. Alright, I have two wounds. But we have all three boxes. Gather supplies. Eight supplies there. Okay, eight supplies is a good amount to have. Onwards we go. So, looking at things then, directly to Irem is up and along. I'm probably just going to head straight there. 
because otherwise I'm going to end up having some problems and we'll have to light off as well. I was actually hoping that actually we'd um, get our terror down a little bit. I'm going to have to go a little bit without light and just hope. Also, spiders. Okay, 42. 44, I'm probably going to have to do it anyway. But I've saved myself about half a fuel, maybe, doing that. For nativity. Is this the prison, or is this something else entirely? I can't remember what this is. I can buy fuel here. Good. I'm gonna buy fuel here. Um, Vestal of Silk. We need mushroom wine. I've also have honey. Just trinkets. Okay, that could potentially help. Um, I don't have any wine, so I can't get a port report here. Scattering reaches. Bring the light to the darkness. Or try it without candles. Perhaps not. Um, meet with an emissary of spiders. Do I want to give the tomb colonists to spiders, or do I want to keep this um, trip going? The thing is, I know I can replace them. That's the thing. We've already established they can be replaced. Um, uh, no, this time I think we're gonna leave. Uh, we're gonna leave the spidery hell alone. We're just gonna head up to Iron. We're nearly there anyway, so. But if we see the reward is terrible, the next time we get around to doing this, not a chance. Crew is fed. Let's see where Irin will lie, has always lain. Allows Haven. Okay. We will wander the stairs for hours, we will forget our scars and stains. We will not leave. Uh... The door should prevent the band bite now. Pale of Parabola Linen. Okay, what else can I do near him? I can compile the port report at least. And I need coffee. Okay, so they will pay in coffee. We have lamentable tales. Unfortunately, I don't get a secret for those. I can buy more of this if I want to. Um, captivating treasure. Which I can sell for 50 fuels, apparently. I can buy seven strange catches now, actually. What's the hold looking like? Hold is basically at capacity. I can sell Searing Enigma for extraordinary implications. Is this what I want to do? Is that better, actually? Um, Dread Sunrise. I sell one of those for 10 Syrian Enigmas. So there's obviously something else I can do here. Uh, 
Okay, so let's, um, rather than toss things off, I'm going to sell four, five supplies. And then, if I also sell off I can buy a watchful curio for one, and that allows me to speak to the guy in Tolifrian, doesn't it? I've distracted myself now and bought something else I don't particularly need. Alright, let's have a look at the cargo. What can I toss overboard? I'll toss that overboard for now. I'm not going to toss that because I know that's worth something, and this is worth a lot to me, so. Done. I need to get rid of one more, and then I can keep seven unusual catches, and I can make something. So. It cost me seven of my secrets, but hey, I feel this is probably worth it. Let's sell off a supply here. I'm hoping that I can build something good with this. In fact, if I've got it right, it's the thing that gives me seven veils. So huzzah there. Right. We head off. So looking at things now and where we've been and where we still have to go, I guess the best route is Chapel of Lights, Abbey Rock, London. Or... I do my very best to get to Mount Palmerston and get enough fuel to get home. Nine and seven. It's it's doable. It's definitely doable. I might be pushing things a little bit by the time we get to the end of this, but supplies at least we're not going to be a problem for. And I realise I've got the lights on. I realise I'm burning it, but I'm on 43. So yeah, I think we'll head to Chapel of Lights. It's also allows me to possibly find some more other some more things here and get some more secrets. Okay, found another rift for 50. <sighs> so you can get quite a long way on two view, but it just doesn't feel like it half the time. Chapel of Lights. The crew is fed, we have five you remaining. Okay, Chapel of Lights, we can of course buy nothing here, but... We can give a nightmare to the well. We shall gather intelligence. We can reject what we have learnt. Oh, we can die in 50. Uh, three wounds will kill me. We have two wounds currently, so I can't afford to take any more. I think we're just going to have to leave this and hope. Nuncio, we can buy view that, actually. But I think we'll go to Abbey Rock, at least initially, because if I can get to Palmerston, which should be doable, it'll be an extra port report when we get back home. It's been a reasonably profitable trip, actually, though it has mostly been due to the light boxes I picked up. And we'll be able to get another 1,200 when we get back. We'll obviously have the um, red, the honey as well, which we'll have given to the alarming scholar, which hopefully will help out on that side of things. Assuming we can get back without encountering suspicion, which, you know, now we have two suspicious items. Or sets of items, rather. Three. I suppose we could go to Frostfound as well. But I think Abbey Rock first. I'm gonna have to all do both, and I can probably get to Palmerston and Vanderblight, which is ultimately where I need to be. Okay, so Abbey Rock with three view remaining. Ah! 
Abbey Rock. Boar Report. Uh, we shall be turned away, and we will wait, watch the Covenant gain five fragments. Nothing much I can do here, actually, but still, moving on. We have Frost found. That's always fun. Certainly was the last time I was here, actually. And if we can count any of the beasts on the way, that will help me as well. Doc. Frost found. We compiled the port report. We have 47 terror, so we're not entering it. Besides, the last time we did that, it nearly killed us. Um, Palmerson, then. It's just so much... If we get to Palmerson, that just solves a lot of our problems. A lot of our problems being that singular problem, along with top bar, which is slowly going down. I'm at one and a half. Let's, let's cook the terror for a bit. Okay, so we're going to have... Yeah, there we go. We're now without fuel, but we'll make it to Malvison, and that will allow us to buy more. Maybe I'll just give up my soul now. You know, we've done everything else. I... It feels like we should probably give up our souls. But for now, there is 11 fuel. That will get us more than home. So, um, do I want to go to Codex and Wither as well? I might as well. I've got the I've got the time, by which I mean I've got the fuel and supplies in reserve to do this. And of course, this will give us an opportunity to possibly deal some with some more of uh, the icebergs. Or, if somebody else wants to be silly. I've got this as well. Come on then. Come on. I've got you out I've got you basically outgunned here. even shoot at us. That's how bad you were. But victory for us. What do you have? Cash curiosities. Let's open you up and find a view. Ultimately not massively worth it, but hey. These things happen. Unfortunately, we are now stuck in the cold. Which is fine for our viewal, I think. Not particularly fine for the rest of it. Come on, you darn engines. To Codex. The Isle of Codex. We can acquire a doomed monster seeker. Uh, monster Hunter, but I think we'll just come out of the port report and leave. I don't have any particular desire to stay here. I will grab one supply just in case. Might of course they're more expensive here. Weaver though is far more interesting to us, so we're going to go and head over there. We've been just about everywhere this um, last couple of videos, actually. This Since we left London, we have been pretty much everywhere except the south of the map. Interesting, I haven't encountered any um, 
need the Frostberg things. My still encounter one a bit further south. They do appear there, so. If it killed them all, that'd be something. Right, Wither. We shall, of course, gather intelligence. And while I am tempted to explore the town, we're going to explore the town. We're going to avoid. She's probably someone's feral aunt. Indeed, she probably is some feral aunt. Gain Salt's attention. We defied the gods last time we were here. Could ask about the drowned man, but no. Okay, we defied the gods last time. It's all good. We can buy Vuel for Z stories. How many Z stories do I have? And my supplies for Tales of Terror, actually. Um. Pick head of the Eater of Names, no, Starshell, no. Alright, let's go and buy some Vuel. Was that the only one I had? Must have been the only sea story I had still. Yeah, that was it. Okay, so now that's done. We move on. The crew is fed, lights are on. Vanderbite and London, and we are done with the video, assuming we get through, um, oh, I can get down here. This assumes, of course, that we don't have any problems getting into London. I still have plenty of Admiralty favour I can burn up, so... But failing that, Van straight course to Vanderbite is the way to go. I'm probably going to have to spend some money to, to reduce my terror, though. Once we get there. Especially if this event actually causes me to gain more terror. We're at 50. Okay, we dock. Team Colony of Vanderbite, so... End of the tour, full compliment. You didn't lose at one. That's never happened before. There's a chorus of surprise protest from the colonists on deck. Oh, shut up. You're here, aren't you? Right, last installments, please, so I can pay the captain. I receive a judgment egg. Is it a soul? 1500 echo? 1500 Echo and a random item, which I've seen around, actually. Okay. I'm quite happy to have a soul. It gives me an extra one. Um, I can sell visions of the surface as well. Memory doesn't show I'll probably keep. But yeah, that's a lot of money we got there. Um, I do want to, however, go and do a Darcy glass of wine. Let's see if we can reduce some terror a little bit. That leaves us five. That means we'll be safe getting into London. What does the first curator have to say to me? Give it the hunt your hunter's eye. I have a captivating treasure. Oh, awesome. Okay. So there are other stuff I need, there is other stuff I need to get to complete this quest, but we found one of those. I was worried about that, actually, because I had no idea what he was actually asking, I guess. All right, depart for now. We'll see what our final reward is later. I like the final reward part of that, actually. But we gained a hunting trophy, we gained a captivating treasure, which means I can make another heirloom, meaning I'm up to three. And I'm going to have about 4,000, 5,000 Echo when I get done with this, so... We are doing well. I'm not going to bother turning the lights off, there's no point. I've reduced my terror, so there's no point really in increasing it again. Um, so back to Fallen London, and that will end the video once we sort this bit out. Restless Nights. 40% page challenges, what did you see? Nice. And a face. Gain the terror. Gain 10 fragments, though, which is more important, and that gets us towards another secret. Of which I believe I've got 7. I hope I've got 7. I was meant to get 7. 
Uh, I have five secrets because I sold one. Darn it. I'm missing two secrets to go and get that last bit done. But I do have a load of catches, so I suppose I can always do it. You just ram me. Well, you know what? You probably deserve that. You destroy this tramp steamer. Innocent men and women are dead, but that's not their problem. If you're caught... Eh, yeah, okay, fine. What's this? Here's what they found. Worth it! It wasn't. <laughs> it wasn't. Alright, I should have left them alone, but they were just sitting there. It was too easy. I have big guns on this ship now. This is probably going to go bad. Oh well. Means that my terror has gone back up. God darn it. Oh well, back in London. Rapid relief. This has increased the nightmare's strength. Oh, Master, what's he got to say to us? Oh, I forgot! I've forgotten this completely, but we don't actually have the Bruiser anymore. We kind of forgot to pay him, didn't we? Ah, uh, memories have just come back to me now. This is what happens when I don't play games back to back. Alright. Deliver the trinkets to the waiting man. Gain 100 echo for that. We're now at free, free, free. The alarming scholar? Um. Here. Okay, we're just rich. Um, London. Let's go carousing. I know we can't get another... Yeah, I know we can't, but it's still worth doing. Reducing my terror for a very little cost. Um, perhaps not for the moment. My lodgings. We'll visit our study. So. We need more secrets to do this thing, but we can make the Whispering Trophy case once we get a few more. I will, however, go for the Captivating Treasure, because we picked that up now. I know a free heirlooms in reserve. And... yeah, that'll have to do. I need a lot of stuff here. In fact, 77 secrets I know I know did something there. And a load of port reports, and a Dread Sunrise. I suppose that is our ambition. So we can retire happily if we can complete that ambition. But that's that's what we got to do, and that's a lot of stuff, I think. Um, let's go to the shops then. So what can I actually sell from what I've got here? We can sell. Yeah, we can sell that. I didn't get any skin lock, which is um, annoying. But we've got a request to do something. No point in buying a secure apart apartment. We don't have the ability to do that. Calamitous Yards is basically done as well. I could buy this. Just up our mirror stats. But I feel that we don't need it. So, okay. Let's finish, let's finish things up. Because we should probably do that here. We'll give you the Lamentable Relics. Because we have loads of them. And this will increase the favour with the Antiquarian. How many do we need for this? Two more to reach level 9. I probably shouldn't have given you the outlandish artifact, actually. I'm definitely not giving you that. Definitely not giving you that. Definitely not giving you this. Seven Searing Ending Barony becomes permanently unavailable. Interesting snippet. Okay, favor is increased to 9. What a tantalizing crumb! And yeah, I don't think I have anything else I want to give you for right now. So that'll do that. You, we don't have any vital intelligence for, so let's go to the Admiral. Submit the port reports. Mount Palmerson. Port Cecil. Quakers Haven. 
Godfall. We're nearly 5,000 gold at this point. That is a lot of money right now. In fact, I'm at the point I could probably actually upgrade the ship if I wanted to go for the next one up. But I also want to save the money here because this allows me to go and buy extra captivating treasures, upgrade the value of my next captain considerably. Fifty echo there. Thirty there. Oh, there's loads of these. I went everywhere this time. Five thousand echo went out to. I'm not sure I've got enough space left anymore. Uh, apparently I do. Twenty view. I get back to the surface. Do I really want to go back to the surface again? Okay. Where do you want me to go now? Okay, you want me to go to the Channel 8 again, which is fine, I can do that. And that will do. How many Amorati Favor am I up to? I've got 10, which isn't bad. I guess, based on all this, the last thing I should do is just rest up, spend that 100 wisely there, lose two wounds, which is kind of what we wanted. The sun still speaks my name. Oh, darn it. Um. Yeah, that was a rather successful round trip in all in all. We ended plus 4,000 gold, as it turns out. I could probably buy that, actually, if I wanted to commit. Um, I want to see what this allows me to do down at um, down on the south of the map, so that's probably where we're going to go next. We have five secrets. If I can build two more, so I need one I can pretty much get in the next six fragments, so that's easy. I then need another set of fragments, another 200 or so, and that will allow me to get the second of these items sorted out. Upgrade my veils up to 62, and I think it gives me an item to further increase my veils, similar to what this did, because it did increase my veils, and then it increased my veils again with the item. After that, I'm probably going to consider replacing the front weapon for something a bit more powerful, just so I've got... Um, you know, just I might as well have the most powerful thing available. And the Hunter's Trophy, of course, goes to the monks. Speaking of that... Done it, I can only buy three. Um, speaking of that, let's actually sell off... All this view we were given. At least a little of it. I'm going to buy seven. That may be a bit much, and especially in light of the fact that I need supplies. Yeah, that'll do. We'll sort supplies out next time. So, next time we're going south, we're going down along there. We'll see what happens. Until then.